In the world of gospel music, few names shine as brightly as Shirley Caesar. But beyond her powerful voice and uplifting songs lies a story of perseverance, faith and remarkable success. But it's not just her music that captivates audiences, it's her genuine spirit and infectious energy that resonates with people around the world. Today, we learn about this legendary singer's lavish lifestyle, explore her sprawling mansion, and discover her impressive net worth. Okay, let's dive in now. Shirley Caesar stands as an iconic figure in the realm of American gospel music, boasting a net worth of $6 million as of March 2024. Her illustrious career spans an impressive seven decades, during which she has left an indelible mark on the gospel music landscape. With over 40 albums to her credit, Caesar's melodious voice has resonated across generations, earning her the affectionate title of the First Lady of Gospel. Throughout her journey, Caesar's talent has been recognized and celebrated with numerous prestigious awards. Among her accolades are multiple Grammy Awards, Dove Awards, and Stellar Awards, all testaments to her exceptional artistry and unwavering dedication to her craft. In a crowning achievement, she was bestowed with the esteemed Grammy Lifetime Achievement Award in 2017, a fitting tribute to her enduring impact on the music industry. Beyond her musical achievements, Caesar's influence extends far beyond the recording studio. She has graced the stages of countless television shows, captivating audiences with her soul-stirring performances and spreading the message of hope and faith through her music. Additionally, her presence has been felt at esteemed events, including notable appearances at White House gatherings, where her transcendent voice has uplifted spirits and brought people together in celebration. Shirley Ann Caesar Williams, known professionally as Shirley Caesar, emerged into this world on October 13, 1938, in Durham, North Carolina. She entered a bustling household as the tenth child among thirteen siblings. Born to Jim Caesar, a renowned local gospel singer, and Hallie Caesar, who grappled with a crippled leg, Shirley's upbringing was colored with both musical richness and familial challenges. Tragedy struck early in Shirley's life when her father passed away unexpectedly when she was just seven years old. Left to navigate life without her father's guiding presence, Shirley found solace in her close bond with her mother, Hallie whom she lovingly cared for until her passing in 1989. Shirley's musical journey began within the intimate confines of her family home, where she entertained relatives and friends with her angelic voice. Dubbed, Baby Shirley Caesar, her talent quickly gained attention, leading to invitations for performances across the Carolinas. However, balancing her burgeoning music career with her studies proved to be a challenge, as Shirley could only sing professionally on weekends due to her weekday school commitments. At the tender age of 19, Shirley's career trajectory took a momentous turn when she caught the eye or rather, the ear of gospel legend Albertina Walker. Impressed by Shirley's stirring vocals during a solo performance, Walker extended an invitation for Shirley to join the Caravans, a prominent gospel group of the time. With dreams of musical stardom beckoning, Shirley made the bold decision to put her academic pursuits on hold and embark on a journey with the Caravans. For eight years, Shirley lent her voice to the caravans, honing her craft and gaining invaluable experience in the music industry. However, in a pivotal move in 1958, Shirley opted to spread her wings and pursue a solo career after securing a recording contract with Hob Records. Her debut LP, I'll Go, marked the beginning of her solo odyssey, featuring timeless classics like Oh Peter, Don't Be Afraid, and Choose This Day. With Hob Records as her launchpad, Shirley's star continued to rise with hits such as Satan, We're Gonna Tear Your Kingdom Down, and God's Not Dead, He's Yet Alive. Her breakthrough moment came in 1971 when she clinched her first Grammy Award for her rendition of Put Your Hand in the Hand of the Man. The momentum only surged from there, with her recording of No Charge in 1975 earning her the coveted distinction of a gold record. Despite her burgeoning success, Shirley harbored aspirations of reaching an even broader audience. Dissatisfied with the scope of her platform at Hob Records, Shirley made the bold decision not to renew her contract, signaling the end of an era with the label in 1975. This pivotal moment marked a new chapter in Shirley's career, one characterized by unwavering determination and an unyielding pursuit of her musical dreams. In 1977 when she made a bold leap from the gospel realm to a secular record label known as Roadshow Records. This strategic move aimed to expand her reach beyond traditional gospel audiences, 
signaling her desire to share her music with a broader demographic. With the release of her debut album, First Lady, Caesar embarked on a new chapter in her career, earning the distinction of being the first woman to record under the label's banner. While the album itself didn't soar to commercial heights, one track, Faded Rose, emerged as a timeless classic in Caesar's repertoire. Despite modest sales, the title, First Lady, captured the attention of industry insiders, concert announcers, DJs, and gospel promoters alike. This newfound recognition led to Caesar being hailed as the First Lady of Gospel Music, a title that would become synonymous with her name for decades to come. Following her stint with Roadshow Records, Caesar continued her quest for a gospel-centric label, eventually finding a home at Word Records in 1980. This pivotal move marked a return to her roots, setting the stage for a string of Grammy award-winning albums that would cement her status as a gospel music icon. Hits like God's Got It All in Control and Hold My Mule propelled Caesar to new heights of acclaim and solidified her reputation as a powerhouse vocalist in the gospel community. Beyond her musical endeavors, Caesar's influence extended into the realm of television and film. She graced the small screen as a guest on popular shows like the Bobby Jones Gospel Show, showcasing her captivating performances to a wide audience. Additionally, Caesar showcased her acting chops in notable films such as Why Do Fools Fall in Love and Fighting Temptations, sharing the screen with luminaries like Lorenz Tate, Beyonce, and Cuba Gooding Jr. Throughout her illustrious career, Caesar's impact transcended borders, earning international recognition for her contributions to gospel music. In 2014, her song, Teach Me Master, received a fresh interpretation by Dutch producer Baker Matt, reaching number 22 on the UK singles chart and introducing her music to new audiences around the globe. In 2016, she reclaimed her position at the top of the Billboard gospel charts with the release of Fill This House a testament to her enduring relevance and unwavering commitment to her craft. Awards and Titles Shirley Caesar's illustrious career has been punctuated by numerous awards and prestigious titles, solidifying her status as a gospel music icon. In 1999, she was bestowed with the esteemed National Heritage Fellowship by the National Endowment for the Arts, the highest honor in folk and traditional arts in the United States. Her contributions to gospel music were further recognized when she was inducted into the Gospel Music Hall of Fame in 2000, cementing her place among the genre's luminaries. Notably, in 2010, Caesar received yet another accolade as she was welcomed into the esteemed ranks of the North Carolina Music Hall of Fame. Caesar's talents have transcended mere musical boundaries, earning her the opportunity to grace the stage for none other than President Barack Obama and First Lady Michelle Obama at the White House in 2015. Alongside the legendary Aretha Franklin, this momentous occasion underscored Caesar's influence not only in the realm of music but also on the cultural and political stage. To further affirm her lasting legacy, the National Museum of African American Music honored Caesar's contributions by presenting her with the Nashville Rhythm and Rhythm Award in May 2016, in advance of time the museum opened in 2018. This recognition serves as a fitting recognition of her profound impact on the rich tapestry of African-American musical heritage. Perhaps one of the most iconic honors bestowed upon Shirley Caesar came in the form of a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. On June 28, 2016, amidst much fanfare and celebration, Caesar was proudly presented with the 2583rd star, cementing her place among the entertainment industry's elite. Enter the world of gospel legend Shirley Caesar, where faith, talent and hard work paved the way for an extraordinary lifestyle where she is enjoying life in the comfort of her homes. Mansion in Raleigh, North Carolina Shirley Caesar and her husband Harold embarked on a significant investment in 2001 when they purchased a lavish mansion nestled in Raleigh, North Carolina, for a whopping $1,500,000. The grandeur of the property is immediately evident, boasting a sprawling 9,000 square feet of living space adorned with opulent details befitting their stature. The mansion, adorned with marble floors, elegant chandeliers, and picturesque pond views, exudes luxury at every turn. However, it's the home theater that truly steals the spotlight, drawing both attention and admiration from fans and visitors alike. Within this cinematic haven, Enthusiasts can immerse themselves in the magic of nine space opera films spanning five decades of American pop culture, all while reclining in plush purple chairs reminiscent of an 80s movie theater. 
The attention to detail within the home theater is nothing short of extraordinary, with Star Wars movie posters adorning the walls and a life-sized stormtrooper standing guard beside the projection screen. Adjacent to this cinematic paradise lies a spaceship-themed bar area, complete with a towering statue of Darth Vader, evoking the ambiance of intergalactic adventure. Descending into the basement reveals further delights, including a fully equipped gym, a luxurious shower, and steam room facilities, along with an additional kitchen for culinary pursuits. Beyond the confines of the mansion, practical amenities abound, including a spacious five-car garage and a master suite boasting a balcony that overlooks the serene pond. Offering a tranquil escape from the bustle of everyday life, this balcony provides a serene connection to the nearby Falls Lake, enhancing the property's allure with its natural beauty. Despite the allure of such an extravagant abode, Shirley Caesar and her husband Harold made the decision to part ways with their beloved mansion in July 2021, listing it for sale at $1,600,000. Ultimately, the property found a new owner in March 2022, fetching a sale price of $1,500,000. Marking the end of an era for the Caesars and their lavish Raleigh retreat. Mansion in North Raleigh, Carolina Shirley Caesar's relocation from her Raleigh mansion to a new abode in nearby North Raleigh marks a continuation of her penchant for luxurious living. Situated on a sprawling one-acre lot, this custom-built, all-brick residence epitomizes opulence and tranquility, offering a haven of privacy for its esteemed occupants. Stepping into this meticulously renovated home, one is immediately struck by its attention to detail and undeniable charm. With over $250,000 invested in renovations, every facet of this residence exudes sophistication, boasting 4,413 square feet of living space adorned with hardwood floors and soaring nine-foot ceilings throughout. The grandeur of the residence is evident from the moment one enters the two-story foyer, where a sense of elegance pervades. The family room, adorned with built-in cabinets and underlit shelving, features a stunning gas fireplace enveloped in breathtaking ledger stone providing a focal point for gatherings and relaxation. Adjacent to the family room lies a spacious office, replete with cathedral ceilings and picture windows that invite natural light to flood the space. The heart of the home, the gourmet kitchen, is a culinary enthusiast's dream, boasting floor-to-ceiling white shaker cabinets, quartz countertops, and sparkling backsplashes. High-end appliances, including a built-in sub-zero refrigerator and wolf gas stove, further elevate the kitchen's allure. The main floor master suite offers a serene retreat, with luxurious marble accents, cathedral ceilings, and a spa-like bathroom featuring a freestanding soaking tub and spacious shower. Meanwhile, two walk-in closets provide ample storage space for the discerning homeowner. Practicality meets luxury in the form of a three-car, heated and cooled garage, catering to the needs of car enthusiasts. The home is equipped with modern conveniences, including a gas tankless water heater, water softener irrigation system, and security system, ensuring comfort and peace of mind for its occupants. Upstairs, three additional bedrooms, two renovated bathrooms, and a large bonus room offer flexibility and space for family and guests. Walk-in attics provide ample storage or potential for future expansion. Outside, the residence boasts an expansive outdoor oasis, complete with landscape lighting, a fenced yard, patio, composite decking, and a captivating pergola adorned with mesmerizing lights. Providing the perfect backdrop for entertaining or relaxation, buried deep in the tone of her success is the Shirley Caesar Scholarship, an embodiment of her commitment to creating a positive impact through her involvement with various charitable organizations. Philanthropy She has made it her mission to give back to her community in meaningful ways. A significant portion of the proceeds from her concerts goes towards supporting outreach ministries, providing vital assistance to those facing hardship. Even as she has reduced her preaching responsibilities and appointed an executive pastor, Shirley remains actively engaged in her ministry. She delivers sermons and oversees the organization of her annual outreach ministry conference, ensuring that her community receives the support it needs. Aside from her philanthropic efforts, Shirley Caesar has pursued her passion for acting, expressing a desire to delve deeper into this field. However, her dedication to serving others continues to guide her actions. Shirley's commitment to her community is exemplified through her establishment of shelters for homeless women and children, offering them a safe refuge during difficult times. Additionally, recognizing the importance of nurturing young talent, 
she founded a music school in Durham, North Carolina. This institution provides underprivileged children with access to high-quality music education, opening doors to new opportunities. Understanding the challenges faced by aspiring musicians, Shirley established a scholarship fund to support their dreams. Through these initiatives, she strives to uplift her community and ensure that everyone has the chance to achieve their full potential. Shirley Caesar's unwavering dedication to serving others serves as an inspiration, demonstrating the profound impact one individual can have on the lives of many. Personal Life Shirley Caesar's journey is one of perseverance and determination. Despite not obtaining a college degree earlier in life, she made the bold decision to return to school later on. In 1984, she earned her bachelor's degree in business administration from Shaw University, showcasing her commitment to lifelong learning and personal growth. Additionally, she pursued further studies at Duke University's Divinity School, deepening her understanding of theology and spirituality. In 1983, Shirley embarked on a new chapter in her personal life by marrying Bishop Harold I. Williams. Together, they embarked on a shared mission as co-pastors of the Mount Calvary Word of Faith Church in Raleigh, North Carolina. Leading a congregation of nearly 2,000 members, they serve as guiding lights, providing guidance and spiritual support to their community. Tragically, Shirley's journey with Harold was cut short with his passing in 2014. Despite the loss, their partnership left a lasting legacy, impacting countless lives through their shared ministry. Together, they had two stepchildren, further cementing their bond as a family unit. Shirley's story serves as a confirm to the power of determination and resilience. Her pursuit of education later in life and her commitment to serving her community alongside her husband exemplify her unwavering dedication to making a difference in the world. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating insights into the lives of your favorite celebrities. Until next time, stay tuned for more exclusive content. Goodbye for now.